Hello everyone. Welcome to the 12th episode of English Mirror's video series. Know your theorist. So today I'm going to introduce a theorist who asks women, "And why don't you write? Write. Writing is for you. You are for you. Your body is yours. Take it." Yes. I'm talking about Helen Sixou, the French critic. Helen Sixou was born in Oran, Algeria. She studied in France and completed her doctorate in nineteen sixty-eight. In the next year, she published her dissertation, *The Exile of James Joyce*. She began teaching at the Université de Bordeaux and held positions at the Sorbonne and the University of Paris 10, Nanterre. A year after the student uprisings in May 1968, Sixou was put in charge of developing curriculum for the new experimental university of paris 8 wonson sixu was part of a generation of theorists on the rise during the turbulent 1960s her peers and colleagues at this time were michel foucault jacques derrida roland barth julia kristeva and a host of others teaching in universities across France. She was especially close to the reader, also born in Algeria of Jewish background. Sixou's literary theory was boldly innovative, as were her fiction and drama. In all of her writings, she resists the patriarchal power behind Western philosophical and theoretical traditions. The Love of the Medusa, published in 1975, and Three Steps on the Ladder of Writing, published in 1990, articulate her critique of these traditions and advocate an alternative discourse form, ecritio feminine, that is, feminine writing and writing the body. The Newly Born Woman, 1975, written with Catherine Clement, reconsiders the Freudian scenario in which the little girl seduces her father and suggests that it needs to be rewritten in terms of women seeking new representational forms based on their own libidinal economies. Her later theoretical work focuses on aesthetics, epistemology and ethics. Throughout the 1970s and 80s, Sixu created innovative fictions like The Book of Promethea, 1983, which shows the influence in her writing of Ukraine-born Brazilian novelist Clarice Lispector. Sixu's dramatic work also underwent a shift at this time after meeting Ariane Nushkin, experimental director at the Théâtre du Soleil, to which she contributed several plays, including the terrible but unfinished story of Norodom Sihanouk, King of Cambodia, produced in 1985, that explored the nature of power, responsibility and memory. Sexu continues to write fiction and theory. In 2000, she published a collection of memoirs, Daydreams of the Wild Woman. 
Thank you. Hope you all enjoyed this video. Please share and subscribe.